Hello fellow RC enthusiasts. I am just a few months into this hobby and I love it. Uh, case in point, you know the body I'm working on here for my SCT410.3 uh, over here. <clears throat> over here, I have a few other vehicles I'm working on. So let me go ahead and set you down here. There we go. Now there's a few things that I've learned so far. And let me come right back to you here. These guys, fantastic little tools. Uh, it's worked wonderfully for me. They haven't worn out. It's, it's been great, but uh, they're, they're short. And in a lot of cases, they don't reach where I need them to reach. Now, uh, I have borrowed a friend's MIP set, and it's been great. Now, when I started, I bought these guys. Uh, just a generic metric set from Amazon, and they were great. You know, I, I put them in a you know, quarter-inch hex holder and whatever. It, it worked for what it needed to work, but, but once I got a little bit involved, it didn't work so well. Now, this thing has been the single greatest thing I've ever purchased. It's got a quick lock, so you just push in, lock, okay? Push uh, out, popped out. Any of the hex bits you push in, push in. Now I got the MIP bits, and all you have to do is, this is a gyroscope, so there's no clutch necessary. You just press the button wherever you start, and it starts to vibrate, no matter up or down. It doesn't move until you rotate. Left, there we go. And you can actually feel the torque, you know, or even on super small bits, you can feel how quick uh, or how how tight you're tightening things easily. There is a little bit of slop as far as back and forth. Now, if you like manual uh, tools, this right here is the thing to get. I bought this on a whim from Amazon, uh, thinking whatever it's a, it's called Weha, but it's made in Germany. Uh, it locks, so you lock out, it's always ready to accept the bit. So you push in, there is no flex, none. Left, right, up, down, whatsoever, there's no flex. It basically becomes a bit, like this is a full on screwdriver. And if you want a quick release, you can, and it will spring back down. Or if you want to have it ready to accept the bit no matter what, you just push it in, or push it the whole way out, and it's ready to go until you lock it back down. It will not come out. These are the two best tools I've found for this hobby. The MIP bits, the speed bits, the DeWalt gyroscopic screwdriver. It doesn't have a clutch, but I mean, you can, as you can see, you can move this however slowly you want, just by rotating your hand ever so slightly. And then when you get slightly tight, you let go, and you can still move it manually and tighten it. And then if you really need to get fine, put that guy in, lock it in, done. It is fantastic.